on previous videos um, I will explain I will have explained that when starting these gardener engines for the first time one of the things we need to look for is that the rockers here are oiling properly there should be a, a significant flow of oil through each one of these holes here on the rockers so <clears throat> I'm often asked what do you do if there's no oil what approaches can you take so the first thing we'll do is we'll fire this engine up here and you'll see that this rocker here on number one is not oiling as it should be you'll see a fairly significant flow of oil from the others but not from this one and then we'll take a look at what you can do about that as i explained you can see here that that exhaust rocker on number one is getting very little oil the others you can see there are getting um if not a copious supply certainly an adequate supply the oil runs along the rocker and runs down onto the springs and equally so onto the push rod uh, i believe that's actually a gardener patented idea and it certainly it works it works very well super job Okay, our standard approach here is we simply take the airline and we put the airline on the hole here like this and give it a blast of air. Now, the airline is not actually up to pressure at the moment, but you know what I mean. Just simply put the airline on there and give that a good blast of air down through that hole. Now, if you don't have an airline, you can buy uh, canisters of compressed air uh, that will do the same job. Now, another thing you can do is you can simply get uh, a little piece of wire like this, ideally a fairly hard wire. This is welding wire and we can very gently push it down that hole there and unblock whatever it is that's stopping the oil from coming up. Be really very careful that you don't break this wire off inside the hole because then you've really got a big problem. Um, with the engine at top dead centre, and you'll know that because this rocker will be unable to move here, you can also physically move the rocker back and forward on its shaft, and that can also help to uh, clear any blockage there. So we'll fire up again now, and we'll, we'll see what effect those um, treatments have made. So thank you very much for uh, joining me on this short video. Uh, I hope that's useful to you.